before this video starts i just want to say that the following gameplay i do not own and i am not making any money off it this is all for free and no profit is being made on these videos what is up my original bagels and welcome to some call of duty modern warfare gameplay and like i said i do not own the gameplay or anything like that but this gameplay kind of be chopped up and i'll, I'll show images as well of the guns and yeah let's get into it so today guys i want to talk to you all about is all of the primary weapons that are confirmed to be in modern warfare so far anyway now of course august 1st will show us more weapons however these are the weapons that we got to see in the 2v2 game mode that is on that the gameplay is on that legion syndicate courage jd and tp were all using so the first primary weapon we will talk about is the f or 556 this is basically the famas that we have seen in other cod games however it's not like the one in black ops 1 where it was a fully automatic one this is a three round burst weapon now in game it's called the f or 556 however in our world it's called the FAMAS now because of licensing I'm presuming they can't call it, it call it the FAMAS now I think this weapon is kind of OP but not OP at the same time just like the Modern Warfare 2's FAMAS is what I'm basically basing my judgement on next we have the MP5 this is a weapon that we saw in the original Call of Duty Modern Warfare now the fire rate for this weapon looks to be okay and it seems to be best used for close range encounters however you probably might get away with using that medium range as well it's basically going to be the same gun like we saw in the modern warfare series which was a pretty good gun so then i kind of say this gun will probably be used at the start of the game and could be op at the start until the until they nerf it anyway now we will see our first sniper rifle named the AX50 which is based on the real world AW50 now it's kind of just a model of it and it's a bolt action sniper rifle and what we have seen it seems to be a one shot kill however we've only seen kind of it shoot the chest or up from the chest and I guess that's good for snipers but basically annoying for anyone else because quick scopers are just going to be so annoying if they keep using this weapon and just get the fucking kill up next we have the m91 now this is a light machine gun and when i was doing my research on this weapon it kept on coming up in google with snipers so the name comes from a sniper which is kind of odd but it's kind of lazy as well because that's kind of what infinity war would do but this weapon is an LMG which seems to have a good fire rate and kind of a bit to moderate recoil but not too much. Now we will see our first sniper rifle named the AX50 which is based on the real world AW50. Now it's kind of just a model of it and it's a bolt action sniper rifle and what we have seen it seems to be a one shot kill however we've only seen kind of it shoot the chest or up from the chest and i guess that's good for snipers but basically annoying for anyone else because quick scopers are just going to be so annoying if they keep using this weapon and just get the fucking kill up next we have the m91 now this is a light machine gun and when i was doing my research on this weapon it kept on coming up in google with snipers so the name comes from a sniper which is kind of odd but it's kind of lazy as well because that's kind of what infinity war would do but this weapon is an lmg which seems to have a good fire rate and kind of a bit to moderate recoil but not too much next we look at the mp7 which we have seen in other cod titles and this weapon for me anyways was such a good weapon in black ops 2 and other games that we've seen it in and in this game anyway it seems to have a fast fire rate kind of like the scorpion evo or the vesper and it just shreds through people 
and looks to be really good however it probably it looks to have a high kick of recoil going upwards so maybe if you have grip on that as well it might sort it all out never really know until we see the game or we just see these attachments on the gun another primary weapon we will be looking at today is the AUG or the AUG now this is an assault rifle and it has a high fire rate now it actually seems to be a lot faster fire rate than previous years where we've seen the AUG or the AUG and it seems to fire more like an SMG rather than an AR so it'll be fun to see how it goes now it looks close range it looks to be good medium it probably is good and then it might dip off long range never know until we really see more gameplay of it or when the game actually comes out and we start using these guns another primary weapon we will talk about is the m14 which is yet another sniper rifle now we actually didn't get to see much gameplay or anything of this weapon basically being used however the bit that we had seen to be used it kind of looks like a semi-automatic sniper and it looks like you could just pop off shots like it's the 4th of July kind of like the one in Black Ops 4 now where it kind of has the revolver kind of thing and you can just start shooting start spraying as much as you want now the last primary weapon that we will be talking about today and for a while anyway we will look at is the L86A2 now there hasn't been any gameplay of this weapon well in the live stream anyway we haven't seen any of it being fired however googling it it seems to have a fast fire rate and of course it's an lmg and it looks like to be one that we have seen before in a call of duty i think it was modern warfare 2 we've seen kind of something like this weapon but don't quote me on that but i definitely feel like we've seen this weapon before in a call of duty game yet another primary weapon that we got to look at from the new gameplay that was recently released was the AK-47 which we have seen in COD 4 Modern Warfare Modern Warfare 2 Black Ops 1 Modern Warfare 3 Black Ops 2 Ghosts Advanced Warfare and in Black Ops 3 where it was called the KN-44 and in Infinite Warfare where it was called the uh, Volk I'm probably butchering that name but still this gun has been the gun that has been basically in most of the Call of Duty titles and it looks nice in Modern Warfare and there doesn't seem like there's that much recoil with the gun and the fire rate actually kind of looks decent as well but however you could easily have a few attachments on it then through this gameplay but you really never know until you get into the game and see it been played and you play it yourself the last primary weapon that we are going to look at is the m13 which reminds me of another weapon that is in the real world but i don't know what it's actually called but it also reminds me of the weapon that's in fortnite that looks kind of good and it seems to be able to be changed from a single shot to a fully automatic it also looks like one that you see in john wick as well not fully sure what the name of it is i think it's like a carbine weapon i think or something like that don't quote me on that anyway I'm not fully sure but there's a bit of gameplay on it and of course a picture of what the gun looks like in game well the little frame that i took anyway so this concludes this video but next week I'll be doing a video on all the secondary weapons that have been basically confirmed as well from Courage, uh, TP, Syndicate and Legion all playing in the 2v2. And then after that week I'll be doing lethal and non-lethal items as well which ones that you'll get. And yeah, that's it guys. I just before you go, uh, link down below to my Twitter where I post updates on either when I'm going live on Twitch or when I'm uploading or when I'm thinking of uploading and all that kind of stuff and if you don't want to do that if you're already on Twitter then just look up at Lord underscore originals next if you want to go down to the link in the description below or if you're on Twitch already just type in Lord underscore originals 
and it should come up on my Twitch channel. I go live every day around 6 to 7 o'clock and I will be live streaming Minecraft. But of course, once the game, once Call of Duty comes out, I'll be trying to stream near enough every day for you guys and trying to upload all week for you guys as well. But that is it guys. Hope you like, favorite and subscribe and peace.